These are images of Egyptians. Who's ever seen the, uh, what's that movie called? The one with the rock. You know what I mean? The Scorpion King. The Scorpion King. What's the ones that came before that? Uh, the Mummy. The Mummy. Who ever seen The Mummy? That, that white dude is a uh, emotep. Yeah. You see Egyptians on the movies, they look white, don't they? Do these look white? No. Oh, God. These are Egyptians. They look like black people, don't they? Yes. It's because they were black people. But don't just take images. Let's actually get into quotes. There's a, a man called Tacitus. If anybody has a phone, feel free to type in his name and Google him. Once you Google him in Wikipedia, it's going to tell you that this man used to be known as one of the greatest historians of all time. So this is they historian. It's not our historian. It's one of their historians, and they respect them. One of the things y'all going to see is the people that we quote, we're not just quoting just willy-nilly people, just random people throughout history. We're quoting respected historians, right? This is a respected historian. And this is how, this is how he tries to explain where Israelites came from, right? He's, he's writing a book about the histories in the different places um, uh, in, in the world. And as part of this, he's saying... This is where the Israelites may have come from. He's speculating on where the Israelites may have come from. And this is what he says, quote, Others assert that the reign of Isis, the overflowing population of Egypt, led by Hero Lysimus, and Judas discharged itself into neighboring countries. In other words, he's suggesting that there were Egyptians that fled Egypt and they decided to live in countries that were close to Egypt. Right? So his suggestion here is that the Israelites came from Egyptians. Actually, Israelites are Egyptians. They just left Egypt and lived somewhere else. So again, we're being confused with Egyptians. But watch what he says next. <clears throat> Many, again, say that they were a race of Ethiopian origin. When have you ever seen a light-skinned or white Ethiopian? A non-black Ethiopian. When this is used, Ethiopian is always talking about the dark African. So even Tacitus knew the skin color of the Hebrews was that of an Egyptian and an Ethiopian, which is very dark. But let's go on. Let's look at some more uh, historic artifacts. This is a depiction of Hebrews. This is in the British Museum right now. You can see they got the nappy hair, and they got the nappy beards, right? You can see here, the one on the floor, nappy hair, nappy beards, bending down right there. You can see right here, nappy hair, nappy beard. All these look like black people. This is, a, this is one of my favorites, right? This is an actual coin. It was in the, uh, the eighth century. This is a coin that shows on one side supposedly an image of Yahushua, and on the other side, an image of the current emperor, right? You can see the difference between the hair, right? You can see the hair is knotted on one of them, but on the other, it's straight and flowy. It's because at this time, it's not a secret. I seen Hebrews some are from, black. Uh, huh? I, seen, I seen some from Russia. They had like on the walls, like the black. Black. The black they all throughout the world. Like I said, we could do this for, for, for hours upon the hours. Images and all this stuff. It's out there. It's not a secret. This stuff was known. It was accepted. It wasn't even a, it wasn't controversial at all. Now it's controversial. You bring this up. Well, why do you can show me a white Jesus 17 times out of, out of, out of, out of seven day week. No right. You put a black Jesus on national television. I mean, really, race just doesn't matter, guys. It gets controversial when you do it. It wasn't controversial here. Because everyone knew this was the case. Here goes the Bristol Psalter, right? These are books of the Psalms, but they put images to go along with some of the Psalms. And let's just look through some of the images in this Bristol. Black people. These are the disciples and angels, right? Yahushua and the disciples, black. 
Nappy hair, you can see it. Look at that. Black people, black angels, black people, black, black, black. 